wake up. Okay, so a new day and a new load of stamina and uh, another copper bar for me. So I'll just grab the one out of here as well. And that will be the grinder done. So grinder on day three, that's not too bad. Oh, it's actually day four. They rob you of day one though. Day one doesn't even count. And as usual, you know what I'm like. Creature of habit, I'll stick the grinder over there. Because that way I know where everything is. And then I'm going to need uh, blades for the silver cutter, which I will make on there. So I need five stone bricks as well, and I currently have four, so I need to make another one. It's fine. Oh, in fact, I have I have that many. Nice. So I have enough stone bricks. I need to make myself is it two copper blades? Oh, I need copper bars for it, and I need power stones. I got one power stone to, to power it with. My fuel's been depleted. Okay, so the next thing I need to do then is more wood chopping. Surprise, surprise. If I can get bronze on the go, then I'm going to be so much closer to getting my first axe upgrade, which will be a very useful thing this early in the game. So much wood chopping happens this early in the game. So much! Okay, so chat, what... What is everyone doing right now? You've been a bit quiet over there. Are you having secret snacks and not telling me? Bet you are. <laughs> oh, I can't hit the tree. Programming? Oh, wow. Sounds complicated. Oh, I'm getting so much more stuff for my. Yeah, I'm getting so much more stuff for hits and everything like that. Now I've completely got those uh, logging things done. Oh, so good. About to make some tea. Ah, oh, good cup of tea. A nice cuppa. Okay, so copper bars. I need to get that refueled. I want to make bronze bars on here, and I need to get that refueled. And I want to keep making bricks and glass and things on here, so I'll make one more brick out of the stone I've got, and I'll keep that fueled up. I don't think I've got any bronze bars at all at the moment, so I'm going to have to wait on those. Right, so I'm going to have a look at what else is needed for the bridgehead. Um, just while I'm while I'm waiting, so I'm just going to retrieve that and have a quick look. See what I need to go and gather, basically. So I need bronze. I need 15 bronze bars, which I'm going to have to wait for. 12 stone bricks, so I'll need more stone. Um, hardwood planks from the cutter, so I'm going to need hardwood. I'm just going to take bronze to upgrade my pickaxe. Sorry, my axe first. Seems to me like the fastest way to get this um, all going faster is to just make more furnaces. So I'm gonna go and just uh, pickaxe up a little bit of stone if I can, because I don't know how much how much more I can take. Because this, or I could just go in the ruins and get, yeah, we could just go get that in there. Just go get stone from the ruins, everything from the ruins. Gonna be doing a lot of mining. At work at the moment. Well, I'm gonna be going for a few hours, so like, because this is starting kind of for the people on the kind of west coast of the US, I think this is something like started at about half two in the afternoon. So by the time I've been going for about two or three hours, and uh, to be honest, that at that point for people in the UK, that'll be like eleven o'clock at night midnight but that's going to be the time you guys are going to start getting home from work on the west coast so i'm kind of trying to set my stream time so that i can hit as many time zones as i can so that at least everybody um who can't make it because they're at work can maybe catch more towards the end of the stream and uh, but it's still early enough that all the all the euros haven't gone to bed yet because i like to try and make it fair and uh, try and get everybody
ready to, to come along. Right, I do need to, as well as copper and tin, I do need to prioritize actually mining some stone. So we're just going to mine the normal stone and sand here. Because otherwise I just run out of boulders. So I just need lots and lots of stone and sand. Stone, sand, wood, copper, tin. It's all you need at this point. Happy Friday to school for cool. Oh, I can hear it digging at my door. Is that a Tilly? Hello, Dina. She's like, I literally opened my door and her little ears went back. She was like, oh, I was caught. Tilly, hello, she's a beautiful cat. And those of you that don't know Tilly, she is a beautiful calico cat with a catitude. Don't you? I'm looking at you. Catitude. Oh, this is so much better. I have like a really decent amount of stone for making stone stools and all that sort of thing now. So just getting all the materials together to make my life a bit easier. We need face cam not to see me but to see Tilly. Tilly is six. And a complete scoundrel. You're a six year old scoundrel aren't you? But I've only had Tilly for about a year and a half. I had her when she was five um, because she was my sister's cat and my sister moved to New Zealand. stone I would say. Actually while I'm getting stone I should just try and go towards like all the, the points of light as well because then I get stuff. Why is it always relics when I don't need relics? Like when I'm looking for relics I won't find a thing, you know that. It feels really weird coming into the um the mines on a in the daytime because normally I save the daytime for going and ah uh, weird glass jar piece really I normally save the daytime for going and talking to people and stuff while everything's open but I, but this is like this is like how you play Porsche if you just weren't interested in social my room's so cold now Tilly because the door's open Ninsa is a is is ninja cat. I like it. Ninsa. A small clock. I can actually that's useful. I can actually put that on my wall and it will give me an extra bit of max health. Stamina would be more useful for me at the moment, but I'll take what I can get. I'm just really hoping for like to actually get some power stones and stuff like that. I've got a small engine, well that's rare. At this point I can't really, um, it's a really low powered scanner and I can't really tell the difference between things. But I really, really, really need power stones and things like that, so I need to dig towards these as much as I can. Ninka. Ah. Are you guys witnessing how poor my luck is right now with actually finding any power stones? Wow. That's incredibly bad luck. I'll just have to sell all the relic pieces and like buy power stones with the proceeds. <laughs> That's what I'm gonna do. But I'm not interested in relics, so I can sell the relic pieces. That's right. dig down to this see what it is it might be a power stone you never know power stone some old parts that sort of thing oh finally oh that's so much better so that'll power things for a while no old parts but i really wanted the power stones more i'll just keep a little bit of stamina just in case i want to chop down some wood or something I'm 
actually going to go sell my relic pieces. I'm going to grab all the ones out of my chest and I'm going to sell them and I'm going to buy things like power stones with them. I think Sonia will buy them. I don't need them clogging up my inventory. I need the data disks though and I need the engine. And I'll, put, I'll have a, a room full of clocks as well. I'll keep them in my inventory actually so I can go put them straight on the wall. Build the relics, they can be placed in your house for bonuses. To be honest, like by the time I put them together, I could get the bonuses from other things like way faster. And until you upgrade the house, you pretty much only have like damage and stamina and stuff. So I, I don't have any relics at the moment. Tilly, Tilly, I, I'm streaming right now. Get off my desk. I don't care if you've got catitude. I don't care if you love my microphone stand. I don't care if you're hungry. Oh, I, I do care if you're hungry, actually. Let's get a little bit of money in. I'm selling these relic pieces. There we go. This is a very different way to how I normally play. Abak, I'm not sure if you're still around. But if you are, do you fancy feeding Tilly? I think she might be hungry. Oh, jet stream. Welcome to the stream, and uh, I'm glad that you could make it. And your cat has an awesome name. Just thought I would say that. Okay, so, uh, stone stools. Make another three, because I think I'll make another three furnaces. I need wood as well. Like I say, this is going to be the fastest way for me to speed things along. I have no wood. Did I put all my wood in my chest? Probably, probably did. Yes, I did. 44. Ah, welcome to the stream as well, Major Hummingbird. I hope that you guys will come along possibly to other streams if you see me if you see me streaming. Follow me on Twitter. I uh, quite often have my streams uh, advertised on there. And uh, yeah, perfectly welcome to, to pop along and see what I'm up to. I do all sorts of different things. I'm much, much, much more varied generally with my streams. It's very rare I do a Porsche stream. Yeah, Tilly, Avak is gonna go get you food in a minute, okay? Gosh. Oh, she's she like a rocket. Like a rocket. I think there's a lot of people who this is the first stream for, because it's the first time I've, like, very aggressively advertised it. Um, I quite often stream, and it's quite casual, and I don't advertise ahead of time very much like I should if I really wanted to do well with my streams then I would do that but quite often it's when I can fit it in around all my recording and around all the uploading that's going on in this house it's kind of kind of crazy hey Voltoth how you doing I'm just oh crafting completed over here I'm gonna make some glass I think as well but I will need that eventually Thank you very much for the follows. Um, for thank the host from Voltoth, the follow from La Blue Kitty, and the follow from Shelly. And also thank you for the Prime subscription, uh, La Blue Kitty, as well. Oh, that's lovely of you. Thank you so much. I'm so happy. People like my streams. I'm gonna pick up some of these copper bars, right? I should be able to make the gr the um, not the grinder. I should be able to make the grinding blades now to make myself a saw, which is gonna be important. So we'll cut out. So I'm gonna need stone bricks and those two copper blades. So I should be able to build that by the morning. I need to just find the rest of my bricks if I have any more. Yes, I do. Right, I'm going to go into my house now. I'm going to put my... I've still got a few people to go and see um, around the place, but I'll go see them tomorrow or something. 
They'll probably give me stuff. You tweeted me a picture of Ninka. I will check that out after the stream. That will be lovely to see. I always love good pic pictures of people's pets. I uh, In this house there is a Tilly cat and there are five ferrets. Um, there are Midna, Tally and Siri who are ferrets who are three. And there is Athena and Ares who are ferrets and they are like one years old. And Ares is the only boy. And he is huge. He's like about half the size of Tilly. That's how big a ferret he is. There's my stone bricks and let's see if these are ready yet. They are nicely done. I will do some for Paulie's commission. I'm just going to check if any of the commissions that I have are like very aggressively timed or anything like that. I've got five days to make the fishing rod. I maybe should try and get that done ASAP then. Let's see if I can make that yet. I need one piece of wood. I need to kick some trees and get a copper bar. Okay. So I won't do that quite today. Fuel depleted there. Let's go get that refueled. So we're starting to get a little bit more of a production line going here now. I need to cut down some more wood. Always with the wood. Yes, Ares, Ares has quite the harem. Yes. I suppose he does. He's basically there to take the Jills out of season. But that's a conversation for another day. A Jill is a female ferret, by the way. So much woodcut. This stream is gonna be like 90% woodcutting. I do I do warn you guys. So much wood cutting. The Zero Truth, welcome! You did, you made it, well done. Oh, you're afraid of the combat in Porsche. Did, did you know that in Porsche you are, you don't actually have to do any of the combat? Well, I suppose you kind of have to do some of the storyline combat, but usually with the storyline combat, you normally have a member of the um, civil corps with you. You can hang back and make them do a lot of the fighting, and you don't have to go into any of the optional um, fighting ruins. Also, it tends to give you a lot of chances if you die as well. So don't worry about that. You can get the civil core once the ruins are opened up through the storyline, you can get the civil core just to get the stuff out of them for you for a fee. So don't worry if you're a little bit nervous about that. It's not particularly necessary. Okay, so we can actually start making boards and things now, which is really important. Let's go stick this down somewhere. One cutter, one grinder, and a few furnaces should be okay to start with. I said I was gonna maybe make six. So I'm just going to make a couple more furnaces. That will just, because I'm not really doing things in between as much, I think I do need more furnaces and, and machines and things. How uh, much wood do I have? Oh, 92, that's not too bad. And I, I probably, I will pay a lot more attention to keeping them fueled and everything. Just because I'm not off doing a hundred other things. It's actually going to be quite refreshing in a way. I think it does highlight though, like how much flavour of the game comes from the social side. Right. I mean, I'm kind of thinking I might need eight now, but we'll we'll stick with six until it starts to get yeah. Fuel that, get more copper going, and I'll get more bronze going on the other one. And I am out of copper. I need to go get some more. Wow. I didn't think I'd be out of that already. 
Okay, should we maybe, while we're waiting for things to be made, go kick a tree for some cocoons so we can start on this fishing rod for Chiwa? Oh, you'll do fine. You'll do fine on the combat on this. Honestly, it's really, really not hard. Bolt off, one game piece. Um, could we save that, please, for another stream? Would that be okay? Just because this this one, I'd rather not have the, the interruptions at the moment. But I will be streaming really soon. Okay. That's an incentive to you guys to come to my other streams. Boltoth might be giving away presents. <laughs> okay, so... Game giveaways tend to mean that I have to do a lot of tabbing out and back and forth things, so... Do I need to... Well, I don't need to do commissions and side quests. Um, it, that's just to get money, but honestly, it might be a good idea to get my rank up so that I do have enough money to buy things for mint. So I might just pop in and grab a commission as well. I think that is actually a really good idea. It's not necessarily something I need to do, but it, it kind of helps, I guess. I'll just grab something that looks... Well, I'll grab whatever looks easy. Grinders, that'll be 100... 50 shell necklaces they all just look annoying to do I'll take the one for grinders it's fine I've got lots of copper on the go so if I can find a few old parts although I had terrible luck with old parts last time I do need to go into the mines anyway to get copper, so we'll just do that. I'm not going to be too, like, picky about getting the commissions done super, like, within the day and all that sort of thing either. Ooh, what's in here today? Temporary store. So I can buy tin and copper. Nah, if it was old parts, I'd be tempted. I think I might be able to buy old parts somewhere. Maybe from Mars. He definitely sells power stones. I'm not sure about old parts, though. I don't know if I maybe need to go elsewhere within this mine to find things. I might even need to reset it. I don't really want to reset it if I don't have to. But I'm not really seeing much in the way of... Oh, there we are. Shinies. Yay. I'm not finding much in the way of shinies, she says, and then find some. So I'm going to need at least four old parts to make the grinders for my commission. And that will give me a little bit of pin money. And it will increase my rank a little bit as well. Oh, always with the relics. My goodness me. Married Mint and the cutscenes in Storyline are totally worth it. Yeah, I know. I really want to see those cutscenes prior to... And I want to put them in the right order, so I've put off like in getting engaged or married to Mint in the series because I want the, the, the boyfriend cutscenes first, which I've missed. So that's what we're going to get back today. So I saw another one. Oh, there's another few down there, actually. Maybe if I jump down that hole, it'll be closer. I do need to save some stamina for getting copper as well, though. Really, an eyeglass? Oh. I'm never going to find any old parts. Got to wait till payday to get the game. Oh. I 
apparently have a very full inventory right now. That's annoying. If I find old parts, I won't be able to actually keep them. How much is the first inventory space upgrade? 400. No. Okay, I'm going to get rid of the honeybee wax. That's fairly common, and actually the royal honey is kind of fairly co No, the normal honey is quite com common as well. Power stone and old parts. Cool. Please find me some more of those. And less relics. I'm hoping these will stack if I can find some more. I'm getting so much sand. Oh, I don't need all this sand. I'm going to focus completely, nothing on social. I'm going to completely focus. Will it not even open the box? <sighs> Frustrating. I'm going to throw that eyeglass. No, I don't want to throw the eyeglass away because that's. Mm. I need that cocoon too. I'm going to throw away the honey, I guess. If I could eat the honey. Yeah, I'm going to eat the honey because it'll give me more stamina back. Better than abandoning it, right? That's another old part. Okay. I'm actually going to get out of here because it's annoying me that I've got a really full inventory. I'm going to go sort that out. <laughs> That's funny. Olga Cam, I actually just did exactly what you said to do. I'm going to eat a bit more of my bake. Oh, no, I'm not. I should do that when... I, I should eat my bake well when there's other like storylines going on and stuff. I should control my character and be a professional streamer. Just gonna, yeah. Um, jet stream it. It's it's all very well saying you could you could do this or do that, but I just when it gets to that point, you just sometimes just need to get it all sorted. Honestly, it's all the relics. And I need to put the clocks in my house. I need to make more storage. Apparently, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go put the clocks into my house. So that they're not um, clogging things up and I get the bonuses from them. Uh, I need to put them in kind of different places to each other. Have one over there and one by the door, maybe? So I can see what the time is before I head out? No, apparently not. I can put one over there, okay. So over here is the home panel. You can see what extra bonuses you've got. So at the moment I've got 20 bonus from Builder License and I've got uh, 28 bonus to my health from small clocks. So I'm going to have a house full of clocks, probably. And couches. Right. Can I make the fishing rod yet? I'm short of... I need one more cocoon, apparently. I need to kick a tree some more, and then I'll be able to make that. And that'll be a little bit of money for me. I don't think I have enough old parts for the... Can I kick this tree, please? No? Apparently I'm not allowed to. That's like the best tree for kicking though. Grr. There's one kind of down by Amber Island I could use. Hey Bowser, how are you doing? Welcome to the stream. I'm just trying to get through all the like super early quests, getting to uh, the bridge to Amber Island. as fast as we can. Trying to make a bit of money along the way as well. So I'm basically kicking trees to get enough cocoons to make uh, Chiwa's fishing rod at the moment. A hypothetical question. Okay. Rod, here we come. Lovely stuff. 
Right, so um, all of these are still going. That one's got fuel depleted, so let's go and see if we can fuel that back up. Fuel everything up before bed, basically, if I can. Which I can't. I need more wood, apparently. Okay, let's go chop down a... Oh, I've chopped down all the little trees. I so need a better axe. That's going to be what I will try and do tomorrow, I think. Get a better axe. If I can get the Amber Island Bridge done in the first two hours, I'll be quite happy. I don't think I'm far off it now. If I had a viewer that was super negative in chat and would help you make some good content, would you keep them around? It, it, that would, that's completely dependent on how rude they were. If they had constructive criticism, but it was negative, and I would be like, okay, fine. And I would take their criticism and I would try my best to use it, especially if I felt that it was a fair comment and that's happened before. If they literally are so negative that they never have a good word, I had one person never ever ever had a good word to say and it went on for months at that point i might be like okay you, you're not you're not so good for the community because you're not everything you say is so so negative and it's hundreds and hundreds of comments or chats then they might they might have to go um but usually if you've got constructive things to say about the way i'm doing things then i'm normally quite happy to hear it if you swear or you're rude, or you just, you know, really aren't uh, thinking about the way you're saying things and how it's going to make people feel, then, then sometimes that might need to be dealt with too. So, again, just depends. Yes, I do. If you do a... Uh, oh, well done, Voltoff, thank you. Hash, uh, exclamation Discord, it will give you the link. Pop usually keeps that pretty up to date as well, so that's quite cool. Right, let's have a look at these uh, bridge commissions now then. So let's see if I'm closer to getting that done. Copper pipes and hardwood planks. Ah, oh, right, so I definitely need the upgrade there. Right, okay. I'm going to start putting the bronze plates on though. Let's start making bronze plates. I'll make two of them already. Ah, this, is get this is going well, this is going well. Hello, Hop! <laughs> I just mentioned you. I was like, Hop does a very good job of keeping all my stuff up to date. All my Discord stuff. Those will all be a few hours before they're done. I could top this one up with some more copper, I think. Keep them all going nicely. This is the way to do it early on, just have loads of furnaces. Keep them making stuff. All the bronze, all the copper, all the time. So I need more copper ore again. I might head back into the mines in just a second. I need to keep some bronze for my bronze axe upgrade. So let's see how many bronze bars I actually need for that. Three and an upgrade kit. That's not too bad. Because then I can start getting the hardwood I need. So I'm going to head to bed. Yeah, I'm going to head to bed. I know I haven't used all my stamina up, but I want to go and get the uh, upgrade kits ASAP so I can start using those. Okay, let's head on down to Mars and go get myself an upgrade kit. I hope I have enough money for it. Fingers crossed. I can't remember how much they cost. Okay, so I can give Chiwa his fishing rod. He might give me money for that, but I've got a feeling he just gives me like fish or something. This is one wicked looking rod. Thanks a bunch, mate. You're Here, welcome. I have some extra bait. Maybe you'll enjoy fishing as much as me. Yay, got some caterpillars. Okay, that's alright. And yes, you do have the option of uh, muting people on Twitch. You can ban them from chat. You can um, silence them in chat as well. That's what my mods can do. I talked 
Did you has a quest for me as well? Hey, welcome to Portia. I'm pretty much the only doctor around here. Oh so yeah, that was part of that quest. You need to heal up or I buy health items. Here, have these as a welcome gift. Yay, herbs for me. They'll help me with my health that will never go down because I'm never going to go in any dungeons. Well, I might do. I also have to go see Sophie at some point and uh, Albert. Okay, let's go and get this upgrade kit because I forgot. Too busy, like, getting distracted by quests. Oh, 292 goals? What? Can I sell you some honey? And some honeycomb. And... I don't know what else. I really need that upgrade kit. Thank you very much for the bits, Jalen Wolf. How much more do I need now? I hate having to sell hopper bars, but I will. 221. I need 292. Mm. Sell those bricks, I guess. Still not enough. What? I can sell those herbs. That I just oh, they only... I only get three for those. What? I'll sell one more copper bar. Hopefully that should be enough. Yes. Okay. Bronze axe. Here we come. I'm so poor. I love my content. Thank you so much. I love making my content. This is a cool game. I've got, I tell you what, I cannot wait for a couple of the other games that I know are coming out soon and are so good. And I think, I'm like, oh, I wish, I wish I could have them now, but I can't. Like, I really want Critter Cove to be out right now as a full game, <laughs> but it just isn't yet. It isn't even made, but the characters they're making for it look so cute and so expressive. Right, okay, so let's get this this axe upgraded and then I can actually go and cut down things for hardwood. I'm just gonna get the the firewood I need to fuel things. Those bronze plates are done. Do I have enough bronze for it? I just need to check that. No, I, I don't. Let's just go and grab some. Getting there. I've never been so poor before because I always take commissions to beat Higgins and I've always got loads of money, but I'm not really doing that as much this time. I can always sell stuff. Oh, that needs refuel. I don't have any fuel. Right, I've now got my nice bronze axe, so let's go and cut down some big trees. Good night, Skydriver. Thank you for coming to the stream. And I will have fun, definitely. Right, so now we've got the hardwood going. Actually, one thing I do need to do quickly is if I've got spare bronze, I'll pick up these bronze plates and get the, the, the other three being made of. Pick up some more bronze. Is there enough to make more bronze plates? I can make another one. If I can make another one, that's great. So, am I picking up hardwood now? Is this... Yes, I am. Great. So once that one bronze is made, I'll, I'll start making hardwood planks as well, because they're needed for the bridge and we'll get the whole thing done. And we're still at the hour and a half mark, so I think this is... We're making good time on this, actually, to get that bridge done by then. Sounds like a car journey, doesn't it? Making good time. I think Maple Makeup's on a car journey. I think she mentioned earlier. Watching me in the car. Level 8. What can I get with that then? 
Tree kicking and harvesting can double the loot. Okay, well, that's what I'm going to have to take there. So what are all these? Extra double drops when lumbering, double drops and double drops and mining, I think, is going to be the more interesting one. Oh, apparently I've taken both of them. Oops. Oh, well, it'll do. I'm going to take all of them eventually as I level up anyway. get as much hardwood as I can. I can even sell it if I need to. And then I might have to go back in the mines and try and find more old parts. I didn't see Mars selling old parts, but I could have just been like completely oblivious to it. You're very welcome, uh, Bowser, for... I hope I'm saying your name right for answering the question there. It would be good to get a bronze pickaxe, but I'm not as desperate for that as I am for the bronze axe. The bronze axe was important to even get the hardwood at all, so that's why that comes first all the time. Get so much more wood as well. Always take out the tree stumps, it's important. Some streamer communities will keep negative people around because they help make content. To be honest, around here, I'm pretty sure I'm the only one that makes any content. I don't think, you know, people help moderate and things like that, and I'm very, very grateful for that. But no one's actually, you know, people give constructive criticism in the community, and I would never tell them off for that or, like, or silence them for having an opinion. Unless that opinion was, you know, making other people super uncomfortable or, you know, it was generally just not being not a good thing, you know. Obviously, there's judgment involved. Yeah, see, Hop, Hop's got my back on that. She wouldn't let anyone do that. I need three copper pipes. Let's see if I can make three copper pipes yet. Should be able to. Trying to make everything all at once. And obviously I have to remember that I've got to make two bridge heads. So, is the copper pipes for the bridge heads? No, it's the wooden, it's hardwood planks. Oh, well, it's hardwood planks and copper pipes. Yeah, so I need six, actually. And I'm making ten hardwood planks already, so that's fine. So we've got another three on there. And then the bridge body is the bronze plates, the stone brick. I need more stone brick, and I need um, two more bronze plates for the stone body. That's fine. See, I'm not doing this in bits. I'm doing this all in a big bulk, because that's the way I like to do things. So we're waiting on the cutter at the moment. Ah, oh, well. Okay, so I'm going to work on my commission for, for making the grinders, I think. That's going to be the next thing to do while that's all working away. I need two of them, and so I believe that's going to take four old parts, and I only have two old parts. I have spare copper bars, I think, so that's fine. I just need the old parts. Now, do I go and check if Mars sells them? Does anyone know if, they, if they're sold anywhere? I didn't think they were, but I'm going to check just in case. They were just for sale that would be fine but it doesn't no it doesn't look like they are so off to the mines we go oh the question was just does mars sell uh, old parts and the answer is no the other question is does anyone sell old parts the answer is probably still no gotta work those mines yeah so i'm gonna work the mines Get some extra stone and some extra metal and stuff, and hopefully this time I will find what I need. 
I've had terrible luck finding old parts at the moment. I'm going to actually change the mine over as well. Oh, I don't have enough goals to do that. Wow. I am so poor. Has the game drastically changed since your last playthrough? Okay, so... Um, sorry, so yeah, with the, the drastically changed, this hasn't, this playthrough here that I'm doing hasn't drastically changed at all. Um, but with the playthrough that I'm doing on my YouTube channel compared to the previous one where I was running through all the alphas, that has changed drastically. There's a lot more voiceovers, there's a lot more depth to it. It's all in the right order, whereas things were being added willy-nilly all the way through that, that uh, original playthrough. So doing the full release run is really nice because I'm getting to experience the game in the order it was meant to be experienced in and at the pace it was meant to be experienced at. So I'm actually really enjoying doing that one. Oh, night bolt! I'm gonna fall down a hole here. Right, so I've done. Oh, I don't have any. I came in here. Oh no. I came in here to get um, old parts and I ended up just mining my way through everything. So I'm gonna have to go to bed. Oops. It's okay. I'll just do it in the morning. No problem. It's the weekend anyway. No one cares on the weekend, right? Hee hee hee. It's not like I'm not gonna need all that copper anyway. Because I had run out. Okay. Head home. I do miss my horse, but there is, this is the fastest way home, I believe, is just to jump that, jump past the uh, cafe. That cafe doesn't have anyone running it or anything. It, it never has, and it, I don't know if it ever will. Four out of six done over there. Two out of ten done there, so that's going to be a little while. Crafting completed here, so I can put some more copper on with all that copper I just mined. So that's one plus to having done that. Also, these bronze bars are about to run out as well. Need all the bronze bars. I need... I don't know if I need more stone brick, actually. Wow, I've really run out already. I'll, I'll craft some glass for a bit. Out of all the... I'm just trying to smelt down everything that I'm mining out. Fuel depleted over here as well. The cafe is haunted? What? No one ever told me that. Brody452, thank you very much for the follow. Much appreciated. Well, I'm going to go to bed now because I've got nothing else to do. This she lab gets a lot more early nights than other she lab does. By a long shot. 